Oh, hard, Dale Jr. Hard lick for Jr. And he is head first into the tire barrier. All the way across the gravel. We're done. Reed Sorensen involved in this wreck. Now, this is going to bring the caution out. Yeah. That you see right here. It. That's oh, what my. got Sorensen in trouble. Oh, that's, yeah. Sorensen just a victim here. And even all that sand and gravel can't slow a car down. It slowed it down. That's the yeah, key thing. That's it right. still didn't keep it from hitting the wall, but definitely knocked a lot of speed off here. To, this could have been a really bad crash for Dale Jr. Had it not been for this area. This is what NASCAR and, and Watkins Glen have done to make it we safer got in this area. Just got taken out by the 88. Yeah, well, it wasn't intentional. He just yeah, didn't have any way of slowing his car down. Reed Sorensen, wrong spot at the wrong time. That's Keith Barnwell, the spotter for the 43. And all he saw was 88 dive inside, and all of a sudden they're crashed. He didn't know why. And Dale Jr. had just hustled that car back was, up into 24th position after being on pit road. And, uh, wow, just no brakes. And, DJ, I mean, there's not much more you can do, I mean, with regard to coming in there at that speed. Uh, it's just, yeah, you try to make a right, rolling, terribly we're bad rolling. situation uh, uh, as good as you possibly can. As you can see, Reed Sorensen here, he's rolling. He's trying to drive around this gravel pit, get himself back on the racetrack. He's going to be able to do that now as he goes through the mud. See Junior trying to run over there and tell him maybe uh, yeah. didn't mean to, guy. Just ran out of brakes. Under caution now for the third time today here at Watkins Glen. Uh, going into three, I mashed the brake and it worked for a split second. It went to four like it blew a hose uh, brake line or something. So I tried to miss the 43 and uh, couldn't do a good job at that. But what much I could do, I couldn't because I couldn't slow my car down. And, um, uh, you know, the Honda's device and all the, uh, the gravel traps slowed the car down a little bit and the tire barrier worked great. And hopefully, uh, you know, the car's not too bad, but um, just real bad luck. We had some real bad luck.